Good morning, DC Reaction. Well, it's morning for me, nine o'clock in the morning. So, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in the world. Today is Monday. We're back with uh, Yellowstone, episode five. And we're going to do episode six. So, I'll be dropping now every week, two episodes a week, every Monday and Thursday. Five o'clock, uh, 5 p.m. UK time. I don't know what time that is. It's probably like 9 o'clock in the morning by use. I don't know. Let me know in the comments if I must let it drop at different time. Let me know your time and then where you're based and then I can work it out to our time. And yeah. So, episode 5. Oof. Are we halfway through? How many episodes is there? There's nine episodes. Okay, okay. So episode five, coming home. As Casey feels the heat from tribal police, Jamie works some legal magic, uh, Rip recruits a new cowboy for the ranch, and a beaten down Jimmy begins to find some respect. John makes a play uh, to keep Casey and Monica close to home. So Casey and his wife and stuff. Right. You were telling me about the... There's a fifth, somebody commented there's a 50 mile stretch in Yellowstone where people the, the long the black train the long black train there is actually a section in Yellowstone it's about 50 square miles of just whatever happens there stays there type of situation which is very interesting uh, I was recommended to check it out on Google Maps which I shall be doing but first Let's get into this. Where's my earphones? I see somebody also commented, oh, it's just somebody sitting here with earphones and it's dumb. Well, that's just your opinion. I'm enjoying this series. So, I thought I'll just share it with everybody. Okay, let's go. Coming home. What do you want to see first, John? Surprise me. Hey, Andrea! Bring him! This is little Joe Cash, a nine-year-old stallion. He's an NRHA maturity winner, AQHA world champion. He's a CRHA challenge maturity winner. Only thing he ain't won is the Kentucky Derby, and that's because he ain't no fucking racehorse. How much? Yeah. Probably get him bought for about five. 500 seems cheap for a futurity winner. Five million. Oh, for hell's sake, Travis. <laughs> you said bring the best, that's the best right there. The horse that Kate McCutcheon's winning everything on. Hey, Tim, bring him down. Five million dollars strong. <laughs> <laughs> He's angry and neat. You gotta have your big boy pants on when you ride that one. You probably get him bought for about a million. Okay, he's got 200,000 in earnings. But if you're looking to raise Cadillac ranch horses, that is your stud. Why don't we just breed the one Casey gave you? No one can ride the damn thing, Jamie. Which one do you like? I like that $5 million bastard that just spun a hole in the ground, but it ain't my money. We can't do it. Don't ever tell me what I can and can't do. got to transfer them somewhere and if they haven't they haven't called you for the transfer then it's got to be federal right is there anything that you want to tell us i'd like an attorney the res is a little short of attorneys casey Besides, there's the element of trust that I thought we had established amongst us. I guess I was wrong. 
We found the burned bodies of two men. Bullets and the skeletons are a ballistic match for the barrel I gave you. That has to be explained, Casey. I found a van. The kinds of predators drive, you know what I mean? And I was uh, walking up to it, and the guy started shooting at me. I found a girl inside the van. What girl? It was Danny Trudeau's daughter. I gave her a ride home and said we should call the police. He didn't want the attention for her after what she'd been through. What did she go through? What do you think she went through? Danny offered. Hmm. Well, I can't wait to hear the reason why there's a ballistics report on a privately owned firearm. Jamie oh, it's, uh, it's his barrel. We traded. Is that true, Ben? Did you trade the barrel of your government-issued service pistol to a private citizen? Is there any record of this trade? Are there any witnesses? Are there any witnesses to the shooting in question? Is there any forensic evidence that ties my brother to the scene other than a ballistics match to your weapon? No. <laughs> you see where I'm going with this. <laughs> I heard you were good. I'll check out Casey's story. And if it's true, which it seems likely, to prosecute him, means I would have to prosecute the father of the abducted girl. The last thing I want to do is punish a member of my family for fighting being a victim. So maybe there's a more elegant solution for this dilemma we find ourselves in. Walker. Yeah, what's your first name? That is my first name. All right, well, what's your last name then? None of your fucking business, I don't know you. You cowboy or you suck somebody's dick for that eye? By the looks of your chuck, you've been sucking plenty. Well, we're looking for a hand if you think you're one. I'm cowboy enough. Yeah? Where you work at? Four Sixes, Wagner, Tongue River, Pitchfork. You're down in Texas, huh? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I was up here day working on the Galt when I got into this mess. Good outfit. Yeah, they run a pretty tight ship. Mm-hmm. What were you in for? Manslaughter. Well, walk me through it. I got a note. Really ain't much to know. Dude got me out there at a bar and swung on me. I swung back. Hit him right between the eyes. That fucker just went down and died. Mm. Can't explain it. <laughs> well, that's some punch, Walker. Well, these windmills swing. They're done swinging. You come work for me. Shit, they're done swinging if I don't. I ain't never going back in that son of a bitch. Put your shit in the back. You know Dan Jenkins? Oh, we met. Hmm. He's trying to open a version of this on the other side of town. <laughs> it's ripe to fall. He's not a friend, is he? Of course he's a friend. But this is business. If you can kill it, kill it. If you were 20 years younger, Bob. Want another? I've <laughs> <laughs> got exactly what Ray right through his mind there. Yeah, I wish I was 20 years younger. Oh, hi, Dan. Who's this? I'm his wife. Oh. Beth Dutton. I run mergers and acquisitions for Schwartz and Meyer. So you work with Dan? Oh, we, uh, we flirted with a couple of things, right? Well, that's quite the shiner you got there. He was in a car wreck. Those airbags, they sure pack a bunch. So you, uh, you guys out for a little... Afternoon cocktail. It's the only kind. Apple City shuts down at nine. Plenty of trouble if you know where to look. You should give me a call sometime. I'll help you find it. 
<laughs> you some trouble. Well, I'm your girl. <laughs> oh my God, I think I finally met a friend here. <laughs> You're not leaving, are you? Not on your life. I'll be right back. Okay. <laughs> Best to serve each. I keep on saying her, but she is. Remember what I said, Dan. Star of the show. Generations. I think I want to fuck you. Oh, a deal's a deal. And besides, I'm not fucking you. I'm fucking her. And if you have a brother, I'm fucking him too. I am chopping your family tree down. Thank you. Send her over when she gets back, would ya? Played with the rattlesnake, eh, boy? Beth, be careful dealing with Dan. He's a scrapper. When I am done with that motherfucker, Bob, you will have custody of his kids. Get halfway up the fence and keep him from spilling back. Why are you walking? Haul ass. We ain't got all day. See a doctor? It's the shame that hurts the most, you know. But shame, it's in the mind. And you can turn that faucet off whenever you want to. Legs. Rough Chilly. business becoming a man, ain't it? Beats the alternative, though. Come on, let's go to work. Break them all, keep giving you attention. He asked me to wreck Jenkins, and I am wrecking him. <laughs> well, I'm sure you could wreck him stone cold sober, Jamie. Huh? I bet you suck dick like there's a prize inside. <laughs> 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 that make you feel good, huh, big man? Yeah, actually, it was quite liberating. I feel like I had a massage. <laughs> Fuck you. Yeah. Fuck you. I'm the only one you haven't. <laughs> you know why you're so soft, Jamie? Huh? Because you never lost. You never lost anything in your whole soft fucking life. Well, I lost the same mother you lost. And the same brother. You don't have them. You didn't lose them. There is a difference. <laughs> okay, I can't fucking wait to hear this. Why don't you, why don't you explain the difference to me, Beth? Why don't you prove me with your insight? I'll show you the difference. You gotta watch him die to lose him. Well, I should be so lucky. You're incapable of hurting yourself, Beth. It's just everyone else you don't mind beating up. Do it. Please. Do it. Do the world a fucking favor. Some died or we would lose on Jamie. You gotta watch your mother look you in the eye with no love in her heart.
Not even a little. And you get to carry that. That's losing, Jane. If hating me keeps you from hating yourself, I'll be there for you, Beth. That's what family's for. Beth's in pain. A lot of pain. Happy or sad? Happy. I'm all choked up again. With these two hands and the rage of men, I think I just killed a man. Happy. I went all in, I got stuck in a jam. That's what you get when you're a gambling man. That's what you get when you're a gambling man. And every day I get a little bit deeper into nothing that is left behind. I close my eyes and my world starts spinning and I realize I'm buried alive. That's all y'all get. Well, if that's your happy, don't you ever play me goddamn sad. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's go. Let's go. Oh, baby. Hey, Alligators in Montana? Well, I haven't seen one yet. Probably too cold. Yeah, that's that's my guess. What's inside that thing? Something here. Looks like. That's so sharp. That one doesn't even have a head. Yeah. What's it on the stem? Mm -hmm. Those are eggs, I think. They, they little thing turn into babies and then turn into these big things that everything's trying to kill everything else. Watching in the rocks. It wasn't no rumor, huh? No. No rumor. Where's it go? Right here.
That's a hell of a price to pay for a job that only pays 400 a week. It ain't about the money, Walker. It's about the trust. Trust, huh? That's right. And all the boys have it? No. Just us. Just the criminals. What if I don't? Well, Jimmy here will run you into town and leave you there. It's not a have to, Walker. It's a choice. And it's all yours. Don't think of it as brand. Think of it as tenure. <clears throat> Fuck it. Mm, boy, you better know what you're getting yourself into. Yellowstone. So that's the first episode five done uh, and then we're gonna do episode six next so let me know if you're enjoying the series i know some of you are uh let me know what you think about the editing and stuff okay is it good enough or should i try other things uh if you watch episode four it's probably different to what episode five is now so yeah i appreciate you watching smash the subscribe button give us a thumbs up let us know what you think Anything else you would like, like I can try and squeeze in. I was thinking of doing like a, a Jim Carrey appreciation week or month. Like start with the like all my favorite Jim Carrey movies. Now that he's like kind of, he's basically retired. And he's, I mean, yeah. Or Adam Sandler. Let me know. Let me know what you think. Appreciate you watching. Peace.